So today we are going to talk about Samsung DeX. Okay, if you have a flagship phone like Fold 6 or S23 Ultra or even the old Note 10 Plus or Note 20 Ultra, anything like that, it will work as a Samsung DeX. Before I start this video, I would like to say thank you to all of you guys subscribing this channel because it's a brand new channel and my purpose building up this brand new channel is to reach new clients, new fans, new audience and I can teach you all these little things and then I can uh, review any technology, gadgets, gears that you want me to re review and this channel is basically, it's just, it's gonna be very, really, really fun, alright? So please subscribe channel, this channel if you haven't subscribed yet to show you what is a Samsung DAX. So Samsung DAX is basically is like uh, if you want a computer or a PC or a laptop and things like that and you only need to do browsing, words, documents, um, Excel sheets and then WhatsApp, things like that, YouTube being and that's what you do on your computer. You may want to consider Samsung DAX because Samsung DAX is super easy. You just need a monitor you just need a phone, you just need a wire like this. So I'm going to show you this wire. So this is basically USB-C. And on the other end will be HDMI or display port. And then all you have to do is you plug this in. Okay, you plug this in and then it will show up on your screen as in a Samsung DAX. Okay, once it show up to the Samsung DAX, basically you can press the button right here to do like a mouse pad and then you can start scrolling anything you want and it will become like a computer and now you go out and buy like a Bluetooth keyboard and mouse and then connect to your phone and now your computer will be like your phone and your monitor if you want a USB hub you can connect the USB hub at the bottom right here you can buy external hard drive you can buy a maybe a wireless keyboard and mouse and then you just set this up on the other side of the table it's ready to go your computer will be set up just like that anything will be saved into your phone when you unplug this everything will be saved on here if you plug it back in everything just add like a computer just like that very simple very easy to use you can see this is 4k uhd so if your monitor is actually you uh is actually 4k you can actually go to the setting and change to the 4K and that's how it is, okay? So this is actually method one. How do you connect Samsung DAX just using the wire? Now there's another way of connecting your uh, DAX to your wireless, uh, let's say TVs or even projectors, okay? So if you having uh, wireless projectors, as I said, I never pay a penny on TV service I never pay a penny on Netflix, Spotify, anything like that, or Squirt's channel, nothing like that. All I have to do is, I go to the DAX right here, if you scroll down, okay, and then you scroll down, you can see there is this DAX right there, okay? And now when you click on there, you can see there is like this right here. Now on your TV, you just need to press screen mirroring, uh, smart view, whatever you want, or your, on your projector, your projector will show up right here and your TV will show up right here. You click on there, it will actually jump into your TV. And now you can actually operate your whatever the third party app. Now you can start playing on your TV or your projector. Now you connect this Bluetooth to your Bluetooth speakers and now you have a surrounding sound uh, like a theater, right? So now let's just say if you have a third party app, if if you're using a screen mirroring, it's very, very different because screen mirroring cannot operate. Some of the screen mirror, uh, some of the app cannot use screen mirroring. You cannot show it to the TV and start playing. I just say my free app for movies or a Kodi, it doesn't show it to the TV. You cannot screen mirroring to the TV. But Samsung DAX can do that. So a lot of people think that Samsung DAX or screen mirroring, they exactly the same or Chromecast exactly the same. They're not exactly the same, they're very, very different. Because, first of all, some of the third-party apps that I have inside cannot, cannot even put on the TV. I had to use a Samsung DAX to put on the TV. Second thing is, my phone doesn't get heat up. If I use the wire or wireless, the phone just act very, very normal. The temperature doesn't get hot, nothing, no problem, okay? 
The third thing is, let's just say if someone attacks you, call you, um, uh, whatever, on your Samsung desk cannot see anything. It would not interrupt your screen, whatever is played. However, if you set up on a separate sound, okay, let's just say you do a separate sound. Let's just say on the phone, you playing YouTube. On the screen, you playing, let's say like a, a soccer game or a basketball game or a hockey game. You can actually play the sound on this phone. On the other hand, your TV was still playing the um, hockey games through the Bluetooth speaker. So basically it will be two separate sound. It will not interrupt each other and yet it will be still very, very good. It doesn't lag, it doesn't slow down. It will just add exactly the same. Two separate sound, two separate apps, they will still add the same. Very, very simple. That's why Samsung Dex is a super, super important feature a lot of people should know because yeah, one day if your computer broke down and if you want to buy a new computer or PC, think about Samsung Dex. You already have a flagship phone, Think about switching to a Samsung desk. If you get a wire, plug it in, ready to go. Simple, simple. These wires I will put in the description below, but these are wires that's very, very cheap and with a Bluetooth keyboard and then you're ready to go. Simple, all right? So start my channel and share this video. This is a tutorial of a Samsung desk everybody should use, all right? Thank you very much and have a nice day. Bye-bye, peace out.